Hi all, here's an example of calculating commons intervals for proportions. I'll only ask you to do these in stat crunch and never by hand. So for this example, we have a random sample of 200 customers who ordered hamburgers at a fast food restaurant and 87 requested no onions on their burger. So the point estimate for this population proportion is the sample proportion, which is just p hat. Um, and I wrote the equation for you. And this is always x out of n, which is the key to knowing it is a proportion problem. So like it gives you the total, and then it's out of 80, 87 out of 200. So in this example, we have our x is 87, and our n is 200. So we put that in the calculator, 87 divided by 200, and that's 0.435. So we have that. Um, let's go over to stat crunch though. That's our point estimate, just remember. So let's go to stat crunch. Um, and we need to calculate the 90% confidence interval for proportion. So we go to stat, proportion stats this time, one sample with summary. The number of excess, or successes is X. So we have 87 out of the number of observations, which is N, 200. And we want to calculate a 90% confidence interval, so 90. And just keep this method, don't. You don't have to change this. Now we push complete. And so we're going to copy this like always. Go back over to our document. Paste this. And now to interpret, we have we are 90% confident that the population proportion is between zero point three seven seven three and zero point four nine two seven or you can say we are 90% confident that the population proportion is between 37.73% and 49.27%. It's the same thing. I just put these up proportions. Um, so that's it.